Hey, what is up everybody? Welcome back to another video. It's me. They call me Heat. Today, um, I'm gonna be doing a sample review from the homies, Pelham and Junior. They were kind enough to send me another pack. This one's called Dusty Gems. And this one actually is really dope because it's more geared towards the lo-fi kind of style of music. I'm gonna be reviewing that sample pack today, making a beat with that. Um, shout out to the homies Pelham and Jr. for sending this pack over. If you are new to this channel, make sure you guys subscribe, hit the bell button as well. Uh, follow me on Instagram at they call me heat. Follow me on Twitter at underscore they call me heat. And on Facebook, producer young heat or facebook.com slash they call me heat. Um, so in, I don't want to do too much talking. I just want to go ahead and get into the video. So let's go create. Let's go cook that boom bap up and if you like this shirt go grab you one they call me heat.com under the merch section it is available now so let's go ahead and get into the video i'm gonna go ahead and go through some of the samples that are in the pack first and then find one well i've already found the one that i want to chop up but you know go ahead and go to the one that i actually want to use so without further ado let's get into the video let's go <sighs> of that sample that sample is called gotta be um that's in the dusty gems pack i'm gonna use that gotta be sample because i feel like it sounds like some like nas big stadium kind of joint so it's gonna be kind of an upbeat more motivational kind of track you know what i mean so i'm gonna use that one so now i'm about to go find some drums to put in this thing All right, so now that I've laid the drums down, there is one thing that I do want to add. I want to add a ghost note. Now, in previous videos, I've talked about ghost notes and what they do. So I'm going to throw those in so you guys can see what I'm talking about. So that's the drums there. Um, now I'm gonna drop the sample in. The sample, I've pitched it up one semitone, um, and it sounds really dope like that. Um, of course, I put a little attack, turned the release up on the, on the Fruity Slicer here, and like I said, just pitched it up. Now I'm gonna throw it in. I've kind of came up with a certain way that I want to chop it in my head, and then I'm gonna go ahead and lay that pattern down really quick. For the bass, time for the bass. For the bass, I'm gonna have to do this separate, like first half, second half. So let's go drop that in.
so before we wrap this up, there is one sound that I want to add to this beat. Two sounds, technically, but one sound for sure. This one's called Creepy Castle in the Lush. It's just a dope poly synth. I'm going to throw that in really quick to um, give it some kind of like ambient feel. There are some horns that I want to add in too from Contact. Just something simple. I don't know if they're if I'm going to really truly add them in, but I know for sure I'm going to put that Creepy Castle lead in really quick. <laughs> All right, guys, that is the end of the video. I hope you guys like that. If you did, make sure you give it a thumbs up. Make sure you subscribe. Hit the bell button as well so you don't miss any notifications about any videos or any posts that I make on the YouTube. All right. So I'm glad you guys were here to watch the video. Thank you for watching. I appreciate you being here. The link for the sample kit will be in the description. Again, shout out to the homies Pelaman Jr. They allowed me to make this banger with one of their uh, sample packs called Dusty Gems. You guys go grab that up, all right? So until next time, um, again, thank you for watching the video and I will see you guys in the next video, all right? Peace.